here's our exercise file and we are in top plan view and the first thing we'll do is take a look at the model in 3D so let's switch to right isometric view first and now we can switch to left isometric view and uh, if you have an extended keyboard you can use the number pad to switch between isometric views so for example here's the number one and here's the number three and now we can rotate the view around the object now notice we're not rotating the object itself we're only rotating the viewpoint so we'll go to the visualization tool set and then click on the flyover tool and now click in the drawing and uh, drag the cursor around and you'll see different views there are other tools in this tool set that can also be used the walkthrough tool here and the translate view tool are also very useful now let's render the model quickly you can see that the objects in the model are shown in wireframe so they look kind of hollow and uh, for a very quick rendering method we'll use OpenGL and um, in addition to this method we can also uh, use the render mode drop down in the view bar up here now let's increase the quality of the rendering a little bit we'll go to view rendering OpenGL options and change some of these settings and when done just click OK and you can see the scene looks a little bit better but it does look a little bit dull so let's add some colors first we'll click on one of these objects right here the seat and now let's go to the attributes palette and make sure that the fill style is set to solid here and now we'll click on the solid fill color beneath it and simply select a color and we can repeat this process for other elements in the scene also and you'll notice how quickly the OpenGL rendering method works. You can see the change right away.